Hi, and welcome back, and welcome to this channel if you're new here. Today's video is on the five Reiki principles. These are some affirmations that are repeated each day and night by Reiki practitioners to maintain a high vibration and to help to cultivate the um, really the attitude of Reiki, which is to be connected to your highest self and to try to share that with others. So here they are. The five Reiki principles are just for today, I will not be angry. I will not worry. I will be grateful. I will do my work honestly and diligently, and I will be kind to all living beings. So how these Reiki principles work is as you begin to repeat these day and night, you will actually begin to cultivate these attitudes within your being over time. It's like any affirmation. So really the, um, the thing that makes you successful in the five Reiki principles is re repetition and discipline. So doing it um, over and over and to do it daily. So I want to just go over each Reiki principle and explain how they can help you even if you're not a Reiki practitioner. You do not have to be a Reiki practitioner to benefit from the five Reiki principles. So number one, just for today, I will not be angry. What I feel this really means is that you will not be anger. You might feel anger, but you kind of learn to let that feeling flow through you. You learn to observe it from a different standpoint that you might have before. Because as you begin to say, just for today, I will not be angry, you get, begin to realize that you actually do have a choice in the matter. You can choose to just feel the emotion for what it is and understand why it's there and learn from it. Or the other way is to be unconscious about it and let your thoughts start to take over when you're angry. You start to think about why you're so angry and what they did wrong or what you did wrong or um, whatever it is you're angry about. And the more you put this on repeat in your mind, um, the more crazy it really makes you. You're actually creating your own suffering at that point. So the first principle just for today, I will not be angry, is a reminder each and every day to make the conscious choice to not be unconscious about your emotions, especially of anger. Principle number two, just for today, I will not worry. This is similar to I will not be angry, whereas if you feel worry, it doesn't mean that you have to be worried. You can know that the feeling has arose and you can try to understand why you're feeling it. <clears throat> but the more you try, the more that you, you know, immerse your thinking into this worry, the more you worry about the past or worry about the future, the more it's going to take over your mind and keep repeating itself over and over and over and again, create more and more of your own suffering. The third one, just for today, I will be grateful. If you really think about it, you're always counting something, whether you're counting your curses or your blessings, because everybody has a story and everyone loves to tell their story. Um, so basically, if you are counting your curses, then you're maybe going around all the time talking about what's wrong, what's gone wrong in your life, um, you don't have what you want and here's why and all the reasons that life has gone wrong for you. If you begin to be grateful on a daily basis, you start to see what has gone right. So over time, you begin to see more and more things to be grateful for. Even if they were there all along, you may not have recognized them as something to be grateful for before because it is possible that you were too busy worrying about what you don't have compared to what you want. So just remember to, just for today, to always be grateful. The next Reiki principle is, just for today, I will do my work honestly and diligently. This one is so important because all of us have to go out in the world and be busy and work all the time. So this one's important to me because 
as a mother and a wife, you feel sometimes when you're at work for 40 hours a week, like you start to resent being there and you start to not put your all into what you're doing. So as you begin to say, just for today, I will do my work honestly and diligently, you start to recognize when you aren't putting your all into what you are doing. So by doing your work honestly and diligently, you're actually becoming more present in your day-to-day -day activities. You're becoming more conscious. You are becoming more in tune with the now, the present moment, because you are now putting your full self and your heart into what you're doing, no matter what it is that you are doing. It reminds me of this saying that my spiritual teacher once told me. He said, um, I think it was like a monk had said it or something, but before enlightenment, you chop wood and carry water. After enlightenment, you still chop wood and carry water. So you just have to start to recognize that there are some things in life that we just have to do. So you'll be much happier if you put your whole self into it wholeheartedly um, to get it done. And then the last one, I, just for today, I will be kind to all living beings. This one can be summed up in the golden rule, which is do unto others as you will have them do unto yourself, which has been told for thousands of years because it's true. The more um, you treat others the way that you want them to treat you, the happier you're going to be. If everybody actually followed the golden rule and followed just this principle, the whole world would be a completely different place. Am I right? So just for today, be kind to all living beings. So I hope that this video helps you a little bit with um, being able to come up with these affirmations. I want to show you them um, on paper so that you will be able to maybe pause the video and write them down so that you have them for yourself. So here it is. Thank you guys so much for joining me today and I hope these five Reiki principles can help you in your day-to-day -day life. Thank you so much. Bye.